Some 50 very well-adjusted students marched on campus to demand their school keep masks in place, even though Nevada ended their mandate on February 10th. These sound like the kind of students who remind the teacher he promised a quiz today. Their governor had said they got rid of the mandate because COVID cases plummeted. Yet an online petition to reinstate the requirements has been signed by over 2,000 people who've either made COVID fear their religion or just have really gross teeth. <laughs> Meanwhile, a dad who tried to speak without a mask at a suburban Chicago school board meeting got an earful from a board member who was having none of it. We need you to have you put on your mask, sir. That's what you I can't, call it. I can't speak with my mask on. I can't articulate. I have a medical, but you're not going to honor medical and no, religious have medical exemptions. exemptions. I have a mask. I could wear the mask on my head if you want. I mean, it's just, you can wear your mask on your f***ing ball. Okay. You don't wear the mask. Get him the f*** out of the room if he can't put his f***ing mask on. Wow. Wearing your mask on your balls? Here I thought I was the only one. <laughs> Finally, Coachella, the popular outdoor music festival, not my third cousin, Announced it's returning this year with zero COVID restrictions. No tests, no proof of vax, no masks, no Fred Durst. Event organizers say if you're in a high-risk category, like being poor or unattractive, <laughs> then maybe consider not going. Instead, go to one of Jamie Lissau's shows, where you never have to worry about social distancing. Oh, now I feel bad, Kat. You laughed at that joke. You're a disgusting, Kat. Apologize to Jamie. No, I'm not going to apologize for being disgusting. What's wrong with kids these days? Those kids, okay, well, they're either <laughs> desperate to feel important or they're stupid or both because they're wearing the masks outside. I know. On their outside march. And I'm not, okay, there might be some masks that in some situations are beneficial, but outside, like, do you wear a condom to the bar too, buddy? Like, you're, what is wrong with you? Wait, what's wrong with that? Well, Somebody likes to be prepared. <laughs> you never know. And it takes a while really to put it on. It's really not that much different. You don't need to wear a mask walking around outside. There's no reason for it other than you want to, like, I, I don't, there's no reason for it. There's you're a big time when you're putting on a condom that all things could fall apart. <laughs> so they can wear a mask if they want to. Yes, I'm they not don't stopping have to, them. They don't have to get a mandate back in there. And I just worry what happens when something very difficult and unexpected in their life actually visits them. I know. That's what I worry about. Young people, like, do you have, do you know anybody with this? Stuff a happens illness? and it's really hard. Yeah. You will be rejected. You won't get that seat in the college or that job or that promotion or that relationship. And you're going to need to have to cope with it maskless. Mm. That's the best point. They're not saying you can't right. wear yeah, your mask. Put it on. Yeah, just put it on. That's like, when I, this... like somebody told you tonight we don't have a dress code and you took them seriously. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> This is the, the nice I, I told you not to mess with that woman. Yeah. Right. Or, her, or her kids. Yeah. I don't think I even did anything. <laughs> I think it got framed in a way that made me... I happy. just like that. I don't have to insult you today. No, yeah. It's Kelly Ann's taking, taking up the... Sweetheart, I like to be funnier than a comedian. You are funnier. Often not. Um, but <laughs> honestly, though, like, this story is so dumb that I misread the headline. At first. You, thought they, you thought they didn't want the mask, right? I thought they were leaving because of the mask. That's how dumb Same. it is. And then I even looked at the video just to see if there were, if anybody was wearing like cloth masks and a lot of them were not wearing the N95s. Well, let's read a book. Like, let's like, yeah. like let's really, okay. let's really do this. You know what I mean? Yes. I don't know. It's just, yeah, it's no, but it's sad. What, you, what's wrong, Tyrus? You look like you're crying. Because it's a little bit. So I had a friend named in high school and I was mad that he had a date and I didn't. And I told him that he had to wear it before <laughs> because it's, you got to be ready. You don't oh, want to no. not be able to put it on. So Terrible. wore it the whole time. <laughs> He ended up telling her he had it on, and she slapped him, and she wouldn't be his girlfriend oh anymore. God. Sorry. Uh, but that was funny. Good thing you repeated uh, it. And I could just sum up this yeah, whole... We'll have whole, to bleep his name. It's, no, it's cool. He'll be like, oh, I'm on TV. Or if he's... He could be... You know, who knows? If he, listened to that, if he took that advice, God knows what happened to he's him. Blew, you know, he blew up a condom factory. Yeah. Probably. But, killed, killed 800 people. Right. But, you know, shame on all of you oh, for picking right. on these kids. Yes. I told you before. They're just slow smart. Yes. <laughs> I, I looked, My learning uh, changes in the past year. Yes. <laughs> I, I looked into it and none of these kids study science. Mm. And most of them were uh, wrong side of history majors. Hey, you got to <laughs> yeah, 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 you're, you're, you're in the green. Stay there. Yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> All right. Up no next. Contact. If your partner makes a racket in bed, would you sleep solo instead?